I'm Lisa Wong from Excel Logistic and Management Service DNA. My role within the company is human resource. Our main focus today is on occupational health and safety. Prioritizing workplace safety shows employees that a company cares about their health and well-being. It also lowers injuries or illness costs and turnover, also increase productivity. When companies prioritize workplace safety, it safeguards employees against a wide range of workplace injuries and ensure that workers get the support they need to protect themselves against these risks. That being said, I would like to encourage all employers and employees to take safety for their well-being seriously. My name is Norman McLean. I'm a retired Major General and a former Human Resources Manager for Oh My Gold Mines Limited, which is the forerunner of the present operation. Um, I want to emphasize the importance of health and safety in our operation. And in particular, at this time of the pandemic, it is very important that we focus and take serious concern about health and safety issues. Uh, it is equal in importance in all the productive factors in an operation such as ours, uh, which will uh, en enhance the performance of our employees. So we wanted to emphasize the fact that this is key and important, and we, we wish to ensure that our employees face what we call the four C's, which is broken down as control, cooperation, communication, and competence, and avoid incidents which will reduce not only our own health, safety, and wellness. I think that we cannot place any greater emphasis for our employees than their own wellness, health, and safety in this particular time of the pandemic which we face. Every single incident that we make, even if we have a miss, what we call a near miss, a near miss is an indication that you're doing something which is wrong and which could lead to injury or loss of life. This is very, very critical for the whole of Guyana. Even in our agricultural production, in our rice farming, in all that we do, that we have to ensure that health, safety, and the wellness of our people are, are naturally done and done effectively. Thank you very much and I hope that Guyana um, will continue to grow from strength to strength in this time of our pandemic. Thank you very much.